Yep. Okay, we'll call the meeting to order of the Otero County Department of Human Services. Minutes for March 11th, Donna. March 11th, 2024, the Otero County Board of Human Services met the state with the following present. Rob Opus, Tim Damashu, Jim Baldwin, Amy White, Tanabe, Donna Rody, Lynn Scott, Ian Boswell, or Adrian Hart, Betty McCarrick. February 26th, where minutes were read and approved. Board approved payrolls for out-of-home, core, leave, child care, admin, and employee payroll. Donna gave a leave update indicating there are eight pending. Average payments are slightly higher than last year and encouraged individuals to apply before April 30th. The board reviewed the December financial report. Copy is attached now for the business meeting was adjourned. Woo! <laughs> there you go. Any questions? None. Okay, we need a motion. I will make a motion to approve the minutes as presented. And I will second it. Been moved and seconded to approve the minutes of March 11th, 2024. All in favor? Aye. Aye. All opposed? Motion carries. Payrolls. Just three today, so a um, little bit of alphabet soup. So just as a reminder, it's old age pension, aid to needy disabled, and temporary assistance to needy families. Um, nothing really out of the ordinary here, though, but if you have questions, I'm happy to try to answer them. And EBT is electronic benefits transfer, so these are all go directly to our uh, customers' cards. You said nothing out of the ordinary, right? Nothing out of the ordinary. Okay. I have no questions then, do you? Nope. Okay. No questions. I'll make a motion to approve payrolls. And I will second it. Been moved and seconded that we approve the payrolls. All in favor? Aye. Aye. All opposed? Motion carries. Justice Works contract. Justice Works is a new, well, new to us. Uh, they've been doing work in the Denver area and other parts of Colorado for uh, several years and they approached us about a grant and so we are working with them for some youth in transition programs that are paid for through grant funding but they also have other services for um, youth who could use a little more support or parents who could use a little more support um, perhaps at risk of being an out-of-home placement or at risk of entering the juvenile justice system or having some truancy issues, um, lots of different things. And so we would like to begin a uh, relationship, a contractual relationship with Justice Work. So I would just request permission to sign the contract with them. Questions? No questions. Okay. So uh, I don't have any questions either. I will make a motion to approve Donna's signature on the Justice Work contract. I will second it. It moved and seconded that we approve Donna's signature on the Justice Works contract. All in favor? Aye. Aye. All opposed? Motion carries. January 2024 financial report. Yep. January is um, kind of boring because it's just the big, very beginning of the year, the first month, so not, um, not a lot of action going on. Um, you can see, though, that we've... Uh, brought in about 300,000 by the end of January and we spent about 600,000. So you know that those flip flop with the, um, with the way that the revenues are received and reimbursements from the state. So no concerns, but if you have questions on any of those, I'm happy to try to answer them. Concerns on my end. Me neither. All right. Four questions. Good. Anything else? Nothing further. Okay. Nothing else. We are adjourned. Thank you much. Thank, Thank you. you.